Marcelo, how are you today? I'm good. How about you? Very good. Thanks. Uh, thanks for joining us. Really do appreciate it. Obviously, a big fight coming up. Main event. You're on a four-fight win streak. First main event in a major promotion. So, how are you feeling about this fight heading into it? Yeah, I feel great. You know, it's a great opportunity for me, and I feel great. I feel ready. You know, ready for the show. You know, this is going to be your third Bellator fight overall, but in your last four fights, you've got four finishes, two submissions, two TKOs. What do you attribute the recent success to? Yeah, I'm very aggressive, you know. In my whole career, I try to finish my fights, you know. I am, it's my style, aggressive, always. In the last... Uh two fights in the UFC that you had, you know, they went to decision. So do you try to even more now try to avoid the judges? Eu tô pronto para lutar por cinco rounds, sim. I'm always ready to fight five rounds. Mas eu sempre tento terminar a luta antes para não ir para mão do juiz. All right, and you know, like I said, it is the main event here. It is five rounds. First of all, when you found out that you were going to be the main event for a Bellator card, what was your reaction? Ah, eu fiquei muito feliz, né? É uma, grande, é uma grande oportunidade e, e eu me sinto 100% pronto para para fazer uma luta principal. And I know you said you are always ready to go five rounds, but have you changed anything in training? Are you you pushing the cardio more for this one? Eu coloquei mais intensidade nos treinos, eu sempre treino muito, mas eu fiz uma preparação. E eu me dediquei um pouco a mais para essa luta, porque vai ser cinco rounds, então eu preciso estar mais preparado. He's definitely, definitely uh, well prepared, and, and it's taking a little bit more time to uh, work on his cardio this, this fight. Good stuff. And were you surprised at all by getting Daniel James as an opponent? He's only had the one fight in Bellator, but he is ranked. Ele ganhou, eu não estou surpreso porque ele ganhou de um grande nome no evento. E foi um nocaute. Então, With that having been said, then, how do you see this fight playing out? What do you make of him as an opponent and what he brings to the table? Não, é, é, ele é um cara muito duro, né? muito tough. É, He's a very tough guy. Tem mãos pesadas. He's got very heavy hands. É, mas eu estou pronto para isso. Não é surpresa para mim nada que ele tem. Mas ele não vai surpreender o Marcelo com nada. Ele não vai mostrar nada que ele nunca viu antes. Ele não vai mostrar nada que ele You know, we've uh, heard from Scott Coker recently, and obviously this fight's coming in Temecula in California, but there are a lot of Brazilian fighters on the roster. There's a new TV deal with Combate in Brazil. We've heard Scott Coker say, you know, hopefully end of 2023, maybe 2024, we go to Brazil. Are you hopeful that you'll be fighting at home in Brazil by uh, maybe the end of the year? Dice que um, ya este, uh, Bellator Soto tiene un acuerdo con Combat, ganar sí. Combat en Brazil y Scott Coker dice que tiene planes de llevar a Bellator a Brasil. Uh, ¿Cómo siente vos luchar en Brasil este año o la próxima? Eu ficaria muito feliz de lutar na minha na minha terra. I would love to uh. fight, you know, on my home turf. 
E dessa vez, é, como a gente luta aqui nos Estados Unidos, a gente sempre é o bad guy, o inimigo. Yeah, I'm always the yeah. bad guy when I fight in the US. Mas lá. It's good to be the good guy once in a while. You know, that's a good uh, a good point. I kind of want to just ask a follow-up question then. When it comes to the fans, I mean, during the pandemic, we had a lot of shows with no fans. Do the fans add something? Do you get a boost when you hear the cheers? Does that help you in a fighter? Do you tune it out? Sim, é, eu gosto dessa pressão de ter fã na arena. Não, eu amo essa pressão, seja eles me ou cheirem por mim, eu amo isso. Isso me motiva muito. É totalmente diferente, quando você tem fãs. Bom, ótimo de ver eles voltando. Vamos ver se você vai fazer isso algum dia. Eles estão voltando para a arena com os fãs. Eu amo isso. 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 Sim, mas agora eu vou ter um, um teammate meu que vai lutar contra ele, que é o Said. Sim, ele diz, você sabe, talvez eu tenha um dos meus teammates que está lutando no próximo ano em Hawaii, o Said Solmo. Mas eu adoraria lutar com ele um dia novamente. Mas, você sabe, eu sempre ganho, eu sempre ganho para ter isso de volta. Bom stuff. E nós também vimos Fedor Emelianenko retirar just last month. We saw John Jones return at heavyweight earlier this month. As a heavyweight yourself, who do you see as the greatest heavyweight of all time right now? John Jones. John Jones. What did you think John of his Jones. performance? Amazing. Amazing performance. He's a legend. He's a goat. Wow, he absolutely is. I think he surprised a lot of people with how fast that finish of Cyril Ghosn was. Yeah. Look easy, yeah. <laughs> I know it's not easy, but yeah, it did. Yeah. It looked. He made yeah. it look easy. Uh, uh. In Bellator, you've got champion Ryan Bader. Linton Vassell is probably next for him. How do you see that fight going? Does it go different than their first fight? Um, Vassell is more bigger now, yeah. He's walking like a two two sixty, I think, but Bader wins again. Bader wins again. There's the prediction. Yeah. Yeah. Your own, your own career. You're getting this fight in March. What's your goal for 2023? Where do you want to be at the end of this year? I want to be a champ. Absolutely. The end you, of this year. The end of this year. Do you think you're maybe, Do you think maybe two more fights? Like how close do you think you are to a title shot? Two fights. March and. I know, in July, and then next for the for the belt. All right. Well, looking forward to it, Marcelo Gom. Thanks very much for the time again today. I'll ask you one more. How does this one finish? What's your prediction for the fight? Marcelo Gom by knockout in second round. Awesome. March thirty first, Bellator two ninety three. Marcelo Gom. Again, thanks for the time. Best of luck in the fight. Thank you. Thanks, guys. You have a great day. Bye. You too.